Hi, this is John Lommers, the creator of Epic Table. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to make the most of the screen real estate that you have. Now, normally, I play on a large monitor, and I'm guessing a lot of you do too, but I know some of you play on laptops, and anytime you're dealing with a restricted screen, you, uh, you have a need to change the, the default layout of Epic Table. So, what you're looking at here is a, a 1280 by 720 screen that I've uh, done to match the the video format that I'm using and as you can see it's pretty cramped the uh, there's not a lot of map space here but we can take care of that so first off this portrait bar is nice but you don't always need it you can shrink it down if you want or you can get rid of it entirely so let's do that same goes with this dice tray Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of the chat panel. And we can even right click up here on the ribbon and say minimize that. So there, we've reclaimed almost all of the real estate for the map. And we can still get at the things that we need to get at through the ribbon up here. It's just when we leave, it'll be popped down. So and then you can have multiple tabs up here so that you can have each of your maps or each of your surfaces um, set up here and can flip between them quickly um, but in this way even if your screen is fairly small you can let the the surface that you're sharing take up just about all of it and uh... and if that's not enough you can always use the the zoom features of epic table to to give yourself a little bit more room to work that's all I've got. Thanks.